Hello fire signs, welcome back to my channel, Presence of a Goddess. How are you guys doing today? Thank you for joining me. This video is going to be a general message, whatever spirit has for you. And if it resonates, awesome. If it doesn't, I apologize. You can check your sun, moon, and rising. Um, this is for my fellow Leo, Aries, and my Sagittarius. If you want to person, book a personal reading with me, the link will be down below. Alright, so the past life oracle deck. I will be using today with a goodie but OD deck I have as well. And I also have my Pisces RS deck. Great. Right. Spirit Universe, High Power. What message do you have for my fellow Leo, Sagittarius, and my Aries? Oh, lessons and blessings. Okay. <laughs> Wars and battles. You've been through a lot. I got galactic. Okay, stars are aligned. Stars are aligned. Let me do three more. Okay. I have Celtic. I have finances. And I have ships. You could definitely have water in your chart. Spirit also want me to put down knighthood. This sounds like um water uh signs. Um, yeah, with the trees. Definitely water signs. Spirit wanted me to tell you that as well. Wow. So you could definitely have water in your chart. Might want to look that up on your, um, you know, on your chart. <laughs> so, it looks like here that you've been through a lot of fire signs. Okay, you had a lot of battles. Um, you had to go through. It could have been a fucking war because, um, war is, like, long. Like, it's not even just a battle. It's a whole damn war going on. You're taking little breaks in between. You know what I'm saying? I feel like um, you knew your stars was aligned, okay, galactic. You knew that you could be a star seed. I don't know where I'm getting at. Somebody could be a star seed. You also knew that it was going to all work out in your favor. Yeah, you definitely have water in your chart. This is definitely their reading. Um, with the Celtic, I feel like some of you guys are Christians, but I also feel like some of you guys just had a lot of faith. Um, you guys could have been praying, a lot of prayer. You know, you believe in a higher power regardless. That's what I'm getting. Lessons and blessings. Like I said, you had to learn a lesson through these wars and these battles. Through these troubled times. You learned some lessons and now your blessings are coming. But you had to learn these lessons before your blessings had to, had came. Before your blessings came. That's what I'm getting. The ships are coming in. Blessings are coming in. Abundance is coming in for you. Okay. They want me to use my Pisces RS deck first. They have something to say. What do you have to say, Spirit? Something very important. Still waters run deep. Hmm. Somebody needed to hear that. That's something deep. Nobody, no other sign had that, that card. I don't think ever. Change your perception. So it's deeper than what you think. I feel like you, you're realizing that. That things are deeper than what they think. Their meanings are deep. Meanings of life are deeper than what they think, what you thought they were. Like I said, you know the secret of life now. Like I said in previous videos. And I, you're, you're, you're changing your perception about things. You're opening your eyes. Spirit, can you tell me some more? That's why these lessons and blessings are coming in. Ten of Pentacles. Two of Swords. You could have been unsure back in, in back in the day. Like, you could have been like, is it or is it not? But you're starting to realize that still waters run deep. I'm looking at this leaf, and it's sitting on top. It's covering up what runs deep. And I feel like there was a lot of shit that was covered in your life, in, in this part of the war, in the part of the battle. This battle was covered up, and it's being revealed. Because the stars are aligned. The opportunities are yours. Everything that you, you've you been waiting on, that you've been fighting for, is coming to you. Yeah, you come from a pure heart space. You definitely have water in your chart. Queen of Cups. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I, I don't know. Spirit's trying to tell me something. Six of Swords. You're healing. Four, four, four popped up. You're healing. Your happiness is coming. Spirit was protecting you and also letting you do it. You know what I'm saying? Like you're a parent. You let them, you see what they can do, and then you help them as well. You feel me? And that's what happened. 
they were they were protecting you but seeing what you can do let you go on on your own let you walk a little bit by yourself you might have fall you might have stumbled a little bit but you made it you made it to where you you needed to go the chariot is coming to you okay everything wasn't black and white you saw the gray area okay you changed your perception you knew that where you needed to go it was going to be a bumpy road this is definitely water <laughs> I keep saying that, but you knew it was going to be the end of the road, but you knew that with your blessings, there had to come lessons. And that that's the secret of life. Hmm. There y'all have it. Are y'all going to do it? Are y'all going to, not just y'all, but just people in general. Because it's like, you walk the walk and you talk the talk, but other people don't. They may know the secret of life. And they just don't want to put no effort into it. Okay? But you, you keep it moving. You keep rowing that boat. Through them, them, them horrible waters, them crazy waters, you keep rowing that boat because you know you're about to get there. You know it's coming. You don't see it just yet, but you know it's almost there. You don't regret nothing, Five of Cups. I feel like some of you guys do regret stuff because there's a lot going on. Sit down. There's a lot going on. There was a lot going on. I feel like you look at your past and you're like, why did this happen to me? But you're coming out of that because you're realizing this is part of the journey with the Hermit card. This is part of the journey. Justice. Good karma. Coming to you. Your life is about to be balanced out. You knew that it's about to be a smooth ride. You feel me? It's about to be a because you choose wisely. You made the right choices. Okay, you change your perception. You're opening your mind. You, you're you're there. Your finances is about to be booming because you did the work. And it's not even all about money. It's just about abundance coming in, ships coming in. You see it now. Now that you got into the calm waters, you see your your blessings about to come. This is wonderful. Ooh, look, six of pentacles flew out of my hand. And then seven of pentacles. You're about to get gifted to build a better life for you and your family. And then with the six of wands, honey, I told you, you and your family, ten of cups. Y'all are about highly, you're chosen. Six of wands always coming out. Spirit's always telling me you're chosen. Five of wands, conflict, war and battle. It's about to be done. It's over. It's done, done. Will of fortune. It's done, done. You come in. Somebody could be getting a new car. Like I said, a new house. Y'all moving. Y'all going on trips. Y'all are moving forward to abundance in your life. For you and your family. Knighthood. You are being saved by spirits. Okay. And you're also being protected. You had your shield. And you said, I'm going through with this. I'm going head first in this war and battle. Because I know I'm about to come into some lessons and blessings. Okay. You choose wisely. Okay. You went with the flow of things. You did not give up. You did not go against the currents. You did not resist the change because you knew with um, with this transition, you knew this transition wasn't going to be smooth. You knew the finish line was not going to be a smooth walk in the park. And you still did the work. Okay, you did the work. And now you're about to get your blessings. You're about to get your gift. Six of Pentacles. Because the stars are aligned. Galactic. Okay, star seeds. Period. King of Swords can't make this up. You made your mind up. King of Swords is the energy of um, using your mind over your heart, okay? And I'm not saying you don't have no heart, but you were just like, listen, I know what I need to do. This is war. What I'm going through is war. Spiritual war for warfare, financial warfare. You said this is not going to last long. So it's time for me to buckle up, use my mind, and not get emotional over this. This is just part of the journey. And that's period. And here go your energy. I'm finishing it off. Queen of Wands, this is going to be you sitting on your throne, loving yourself. I feel like some of you guys had to go through a self-love journey, not just a financial journey. This was all, this is all types of journey. Self-love, financial, um, emotional, um, family, friends, releasing, learning how to release without no um, hesitation. Okay, you learn what the fuck to do because you knew what was best for you. You figured out what was best for you and you figured out your journey, period. I'm not sitting here... This is what it says. Some of you have kids. You did it for your kids. Your your inspiration was your children. Okay, you could have air in your chart. Um, 
Yeah, told you children. Page of Wands. Could be a fire sign. The Sun card. Children. Yeah, definitely children. The High Priestess. I told you. This is you. 1010. Look that up. This is you. Sitting on your throne. Opening your third eye. Changing your perception. And here goes your blessings, baby. All right. Thank you guys for watching. If you want to book a personal reading with me, the link will be down below. I appreciate you guys. Bye-bye.